the untold story of Victor Ozyman, the Nigerian super striker who broke through against all odds. Hello and welcome back everyone. Today I bring you guys an exciting video. Any guesses? Well, I'll be sharing the untold story of the great Victor Ozyman, the legendary football player. Ozyman is more than just a footballer. He has such a powerful backstory to his life that the level of respect you have for him will probably double after hearing his story. So what are we even waiting for? Let me begin. For a lad who hawked newspapers and sold bottled water on the street of Lagos, his rise to stardom has been anything but easy. In an interview with BM Sport in October, he told the heart-rending story of how his family toiled to make both ends meet the following series of setbacks. Quote, It was very difficult when I lost my mother, and it became tougher after my father lost his job, and everything was very hard for us. We did not have enough to eat, but now I can give my family everything they want since I became a professional. I've been able to quickly break the deadlock and give them the life they deserve. The Nigerian national has brought his talent to bear not just in the division, but also on the international scene, and his meteoric rise to prominence was a long time coming. It might have taken until the third place game in the 2019 AFCON tournament in Egypt for the youngster to earn his first competitive bow for the Super Eagles, but that perhaps was down to the excellent form of his direct rival, Odian Ikhalo, at the time. His talents first came to fore as far as back as 2015 when he led the Golden Eagles to a record fifth FIFA U17 World Cup title in Chile, taking both the Golden Boot and Silver Ball awards along the way. A host of top European clubs had already taken notice, and by the time the competition drew to a close, Arsenal, Tottenham, Anderlecht, and Wolfsburg were willing to put themselves in a bidding war. German side Wolfsburg eventually won the race for the signature, but his romance with the Bundesliga failed to go to plan and less attribution to his potential to flourish. In his two-season stint at the Wolfsburg Arena, Ozeman fired blanks and there was that urgent need for a change of surroundings. August 2018 could not come any earlier, and he jumped ship to Belgium to try and own his skills, joining Sporting Charleroi on a season-long loan deal, and it was there that his most significant qualities were firmly unleashed. He scooped an impressive haul of 12 goals in 25 Belgian First Division games, he added another 7 in 9 UEFA Europa League outings, with the one he got in his 2 cup appearances for Les Avra bringing his total to 20. Those were pretty eye-catching numbers that even the best ones in the business would be proud of. Yet again, there was little to suggest he would be sticking around the surroundings for much longer than he did even though the club had activated his buyout clause and were willing to have him stay. But Europe's elites came hovering again. Christophe Gautier, the longest serving League One manager, was building a new project at Lille and he needed a no-nonsense, imposing goal poacher to spearhead his team. So when Arsenal put out all stops to prize away the biggest asset he had in that regard, Nicolas Pepe in the summer, the Frenchman, turned to the Ultimate Strikers Academy product and got his man to commit to a five-year deal. Not to forget that he's still just 24, all the interests, remarkable landmarks and attention he's been courting notwithstanding. The manner of his goals particularly has quickly taken on the shape of an established, ruthless goal scorer. Tap-ins, solos, curlers, prodded efforts, Ozzyman scores a lot. Right after his downturn in 2017, in first season with Charleroi, Ozyman scored an impressive 20 goals in 36 appearances, showcasing his true potential as a striker. His performance earned him a move to Italian giants Napoli in September 2020 for a reported fee of 75 million euros. Since joining Napoli, Ozyman has gone from strength to strength, scoring an incredible 45 goals in 83 appearances for the club. He is currently the top scorer in Serie A this season, with 16 goals to his name. Well everybody, this was the story of Victor Ozyman, from barely making enough money to survive to becoming one of the best players in football. His story is nothing but inspiration for the rest of us, One can also learn a very valuable lesson from his life, and that is, you rule your own life. If you work hard enough, you can change all your hardships into ease. Well, if you guys like this video, make sure to like and share with others as his story needs more recognition. Also, if you haven't subscribed yet, please make sure to hit that subscribe button and also the bell icon so you're updated about our uploads. Bye.